Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel or welcome to my channel if you are new here. In today's video I'm going to be showing you how to use the cut feature in Abyss Paint. The cut feature is actually a pretty cool feature that lets you take something from one layer and cut it out and then add it again later. You can also do this with copy but with cut you actually take things out of the layer, like cutting them out. For this we're just going to grab a little doodle here and we're going to cut this out of the layer or part of it out of the layer. To do that, you're going to want to go up here and you will see the cut option. This takes the whole layer out and then put in your clipboard. To get that back, just go onto whatever layer you want it to be on now. For example, if I wanted to move it to this layer, go up here again and then click paste and it would now be on that layer. I clicked X there because I don't really want that there, but if you want it there, you can press tick. While this up here lets you cut out the entire layer, sometimes you're only going to want to take parts of it. For this, taking parts of it, you're going to want to go over here to lasso. Just lasso the part that you want to cut out, so I'll just take out this part. And then go up here again and click cut. It will only take what you've selected in there. Then you can remove the selection area by pressing this and you can paste it right back in again and move it around as you want. There is no real way to access your clipboard which is unfortunate but that's just how it is. If there was then I think it would be a much better feature but this is definitely good. You just have to remember not to cut out two things at once because the last one is going to get lost. You can cut out as little or as much as you want, it really doesn't matter but it is super duper useful in my opinion. When you cut something out and then add it back in, you can even transform it however you want. So let's just paste it here and you'll see right here we have the transform menu. And you can just move it and fiddle with the pasted part as much as you want, which I think is super duper useful. And even if you clicked X here, it would still be the last thing saved in your clipboard so you could get it back anyway. That is how you use the cut feature in Abyss Paint. I hope that you found this helpful, and if you did, maybe consider supporting. Thanks for watching. Bye!